Okay, modelers, today we're going to show you how to drill and tap a hole properly. This is uh, Dubrow's uh, tip of the day. First of all, we need some parts. We need the proper size drill and a, and a drill itself and a tap and a tap holder. Now the tap and tap holders and the proper drill are also available like this from Dubrow, all sizes, up to a quarter 20. Then we'll need a little bit of oil. This oil will help uh, the drill uh, cut better and the tap. So first of all, we got the piece of material we're gonna drill a hole in. Put a little drop of oil. Make sure you mark the uh, spot exactly where you want it. Then you go ahead and drill it. Try to keep the drill as straight as possible. Now we're pretty well set that way. Add a little more oil to your tap. Believe it or not, taps will seize and you can easily break them. The key to get a, a, a good tapped hole to keep it as straight as possible. Now just put pressure on it and bear down and rotate. If you want to rotate with your feet like this, your whole body, that's good. Once you get a bite like that, you're on your way. Just do it again. And maybe make at least a good full turn and a half or so. And back off. What that does is clear the hole. You've got to clear those chips. Otherwise, you're just going to get worse as you proceed. Just keep going back and forth like that. You'll get a nice clean tapped hole. Take your time, don't try to rush it. Okay, we're through. Just run the tap all the way through till your full threads are exposed. Then back it off. Take it out of your vise, clear it off a little bit, you got a little acid brush, clean off everything and uh, you'll be all set. And there's a real good tap hole.